Guys, welcome, welcome, welcome. It is exactly 550 on 10818. Got me a fine cup of Dunkin' Donuts coffee. Oh, it's such good stuff. We're gonna use that Dunkin' Donuts coffee to help us open. A Nightmare on Elm Street. Freddy Krueger, Savage World. Did I say open? I just lied. I'm not opening this daggone thing. No way, no how. I'm gonna review this sucker. Look at him. Oh man, this harkens back to the masters of the universe. Like 1980s junk, man. We got the trees in the background kind of hovering over top of him. He's got this creepy shredded effect going on. You got the red and green sash, which is a throwback to Freddy Krueger's sweater. He comes with this attachable, detachable claw system right here with these razor sharp baby blades. And you got these furry boots going on. I would not want to run up on the savage Freddy Krueger out in the savage world, man. You got these leather wraps going around his arms right here. And we float this little hood back on his head instead of the, the brown hat he's sporting this really sweet cloaky hood sort of deal. On the backs of these, we got Michael Myers, we got Leather Fels, we've got Pinned, we got Freddy Krueger, and we got Jason Voorhees, right? So it says collect them all. Only ones I'm worried about collecting are the main men, we know the main trio. We got Michael Mars right here. Resurrection, got this sweet, awesome mask. We got the workman blue going on right here. Got his blade right here. You know what's kind of funny with this one? We got this sort of tattered peasant cloak going on right here. Kind of goes up underneath his belt. But comparatively to Freddy Krueger, Freddy Krueger, the Krueger Burger, right here it definitely looks more like from a savage world on on this piece um i don't know the i guess the mask sort of feels fairly modern i think it's kind of cool they still has the butcher knife even though it's supposed to be savage world i kind of see pretty Kruger's claws right here being a part of like a savage world sort of torture chamber, sort of a torture device back in that time. When we got this piece in the mail, we got this sucker all bent up. Look at that, Michael Myers package is all bent. Getting this brand new, you know, getting shipped to your house, all these creases and stuff. Freddy's package is pretty good, pretty straightforward. Look at that glare. But on Halloween Michael Myers, it's all bent up. Looks the same on the back, got the same characters and junk on the back. As we can see, this is a spin-off of Funko's good stuff these days. And so we got some really cool stuff coming out by Funko and, and Super 7 and all those guys right now. Got a lot of cool stuff floating out from all these characters. Actually, he has two blades. I should have really mentioned that he has two blades that he can kind of spin around and flip at you. Now, last but not least is my main man. Yeah, Jason Voorhees. Now, you talk about one that looks like he's ready for battle. I mean, this dude's got a bone battle axe. He's got him like a short broadsword right here made out of with a bone handle. This feels savage. I mean, the other two, I don't know. They, I mean, they, they're kind of creepy looking and they're cool. I like them, don't get me wrong. I love them, actually, and uh, this thing is so awesome now. But Jason, man, I mean, he is full gear. Look, he's all zombied out. Got them ribs showing up out of his chest right there. And he got these wraps on his arms. Got leather studded wrap here, leather studded wrap wristband. And we got the ripped up cloak and such. Now down on the feet, we got the furry boots, much like the other two. And uh, but, I mean, look at it. He's got the chain wrapped around him. Everything about this screams Savage World. Friday the 13th, man. Jason Voorhees, Savage World by Funko. This is kicking some hind end. Got this major V flyer right here. Uh oh, coffee time. Hold on. Oh, man. You got the trees going up in the background on this one, too. So, basically, the packaging is all the same except for the titles, Halloween Resurrection, Friday the 13th, Nightmare on Elm Street. These are all five and a half inch figures. So 
I've been waiting for this. Thanks again to J Money Flavor for sending these awesome pieces that are a part of the horror collection that is here at Vision Vintage. And I hope you guys have enjoyed getting to see these guys. It's the first week of October. These guys are my favorite horror icons of all time. I can do without Leatherface, I can do without Pinhead, but you cannot do without Michael, Jason, and Freddy Krueger. These are the three that kept me up all during the Halloween season, watching these things on USA up all night or USA anytime. TBS used to play these things. TNT, is it TNT? I can't really remember, but they, all these things used to play. And there were different versions on, on TV of their movies, you know, where they had slightly different editings and things like that. But these are the ones that kept me up during Halloween season, man. So I'm wanting to do a giveaway. Uh, we've now got quite a few subscribers and things are going well here at the channel. <laughs> you can also check out pitvipersunglasses.com and you can use the agent code of mine, which is DK the Neon Turtle for 20% off those awesome sunglasses. <laughs> You can, as you can subscribe, you can spread the word and try to get us to like thousands of subscribers. You get us to like maybe like, I don't know, maybe like 1 million subscribers. Maybe like sometime it might even go to like 250 million subscribers. Like I'll have more than Family Fun Pack and Toy Genie combined. I think what we need to do is try to spread the word and get this thing going. And then, I, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do this month since I have like 100,000 views or more on this Dagon Jurassic Park video. And, 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 and I got like 700 and some subscribers now. I think what I'm going to do is I think I'm going to do like a free giveaway. I think I'm going to do like a trick or treat box. I'm going to have like a box with like treats in it, like things I'm going to send out that you guys are going to enjoy. But anyhow, you know, Halloween's coming up real soon. I'm going to try to get out a video a week. I don't know if it's going to be able because things have been crazy, man. Smashed into a deer. Things have been going nuts here at the channel. So uh, it's kind of hard. But thanks J Money Flavor Industries for setting me up with these bad boys. I got a lot more. I got a lot more to come. I got some other stuff that's coming too. I mean, there's going to be like other horror stuff it's gonna be some boggling stuff we're gonna have a lot of horror stuff this this season this 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 uh, 2018 this halloween season 2018 we're gonna have some really cool stuff we're gonna have a bunch of other toys i got hundreds and thousands of toys i'm gonna be sharing with you guys uh over the next you know like several like 15 20 years because you know youtube's gonna be around for that long plus by that time i'm gonna have like 255,261 million subscribers and i'm just gonna be like you know just rolling into dough at home i'm gonna be like sitting drinking g fuel just for the fun of it, you know. Dad going to some good G fuel. Jumping on a trampoline and like watching cash bounce in, you know what I mean? Boom! Right. I do this because I love it. And and I think a lot of people forget once their channel gets really big. I think they forget where they came from. And so we're gonna do some cool stuff on the channel. Stay tuned for the Halloween season. I hope they'll do a booberry review sometime soon if Walmart would ever get restocked on booberry. Like I tried to get it for three weeks in a row and they still don't have any. Might have a couple of squirrels on a hairbrush review. You. I forgot my coffee. Where'd my coffee go? Stay tuned. Subscribe. Spread the word, man. Spread the Halloween love. Oh, yeah. Wait a second. Wait a second. I almost forgot. Go check out Scare Views Jason Voorhees on Facebook. Scare Views Jason Voorhees. Check that out. Like that page, man. Get that sucker booming and busting because right now I've been working on a haunted house and I've been like playing the part of part two, Jason. I got a buddy that plays part seven, Jason, and we're like been scaring people to death. They've been falling down. People screaming, like falling through walls, like big explosions and like army tank shooting. Well, I mean, none of that, but we have been scaring people and it's been a lot of fun time. So if you want to go on and see some of our promo videos and stuff that we shot, we got a couple things on this channel about that you can check from last year. But anyhow, go check out Scare Reviews, Jason Voorhees. It's, you know, pretty awesome, pretty awesome stuff. We've, you know, a lot of hard work. We put a lot of hard work on that, all this. So who's your favorite? Who is your favorite? Is it Michael Myers? Is it Jason Voorhees? Is it Freddy Krueger? Yeah, I mean, like give comments and tell me what's awesome about each one. Tell me who you're favorite is and why and then tell me you know you know tell me stuff happy halloween happy almost halloween